Okay, we are on the Monday after the rain delay Daytona 500 gets pushed back, as evidence right here. So I'm going to make an interesting prediction for you guys, based on a trending thing going on in the NASCAR world. Now, if you saw the Truck Series and Nationwide Series races, you will know that the two winners, John King and James Busher, have never won a NASCAR race before in any of the three main divisions. Based on that, I predict that a driver who has never ever won in a NASCAR race in any of the three main divisions, like Trevor Bain last year, is going to win this year's race. And among the entire 43 car field, only six drivers qualify for this theory. David Stremme, Tony Raines, Landon Castle, Danica Patrick, A.J. Almendingbat, and Michael McDowell. Now, in case you haven't noticed, I marked all the drivers under this theory with dots. The ones with stars beside them, which are Reigns, Danica, and McDowell, as the girls off by 4,000 are showcase. Those are actually the three drivers I can trust. Almendingbat, Castle, and Stremmy. I know we're close to trust due to previous issues and other racing series that sometimes in Elming Dingbath's case <laughs> and Stremmy and Castle's case issues with my drivers as the dude lost his showcase and the girl won as you can see right there therefore if in case you haven't figured it out by now my prediction is the winner of the Daytona 500 based on the trend is either going to be Tony Raines Danica Patrick or Michael McDowell. And personally, I'll die laughing if it's Danica. <laughs> Could you imagine what's going to happen to the NASCAR world if Danica wins? <laughs> oh dear, that's not good. Yeah, what about Daytona? Are they going to see any sunshine today? Doubt it. Anyway, that's my prediction. It's either going to be McDowell, Danica, or Reigns who gets the win. If Bauman Dingbat or Stremmy wins, more power to Meredith. That's two of her guys. If Castle wins, err. <laughs> and that's basically my uh, Daytona 500 prediction. <laughs> so, enjoy the race, everybody. Okay, screw that plan. It looks like it's going to start at 7, not noon. Because of rain. You know, it'd be better if we had the Pokemon Rayquaza to use airlock so we can get rid of the rain. <laughs> Maybe that would work if Pokemon were real. And I still wish to see that one day. No, I'm not kidding. Oh, well. Well, I'm not even interested in basketball, so I'll go watch something else. You guys get ready for the race and have a little fun. And for the record, I will still root for my NASCAR dozen, but my prediction still stands based on the trend. So don't ask, please. Have fun, everybody!